chocolate fit er <laughs> earlier today. Well, sometimes it's the little things that inspire an athlete to make it to the top of his sport and become a champion. For a Newberry College wrestler, Bryant Blanton, inspiration came in a pair of shoes. Mandy Mitchell with the story. They are a symbol of the past and a keepsake for the future. During some of the most important matches of his life, these shoes were there for Bryant Blanton. My mom brought my first ever pair of wrestling shoes to the tournament and uh, gave them to Coach Pack, who put them on the corner of the mat every time I wrestled. Bryant adopted a love for the sport while others were watching cartoons. His father, Jimmy, was a high school wrestling coach. He's been wrestling since he could walk, basically. My mom has always called me a, a bleacher baby because I, I grew up in the bleachers. Got 30. And years later, the early exposure to the sport is obvious when Bryant is on the mat. He won state titles while at Somerville High School. And last year at Newberry College, he took home the Division II NCAA National Championship. It's some innate ability. When the lights come on, he just wins. If you live for that, then, then you show up and, and that's the time that you get to go out there and shine. So it was no surprise to see Bryant holding up a trophy, standing on top of a podium, the NCAA champion. The tiny shoes draped around his neck. They made a few picture appearances and, and people got to see that. Two reminders of a father who wasn't there to see his son reach the top of his sport. Jimmy died when Bryant was only 10 years old. That was the biggest thing he gave me was, was introducing me to wrestling and, and giving me a love for the sport. It just all came forward. Uh, the emotion and keeping it in when he won last year. It's a tribute to him and what his dad taught him. Now a senior, Bryant is working to defend his title. And he says he knows his dad would be proud of the man the bleacher baby has become. As long as I keep pushing to stay close to him in that way, then, then he'll be with me as long as I'm alive. Mandy Mitchell, WIS News 10 Sports. His dad.